<laughs> Hi, Woodenville families. This is Kelly at home with your scavenger hunt of the week. I hope the background noise isn't too noisy. My husband and one of my sons are watching a movie just downstairs, so I'm trying to find a nice quiet corner, but I apologize if there's any background noise that is disturbing. Anywho, I uh, hope you guys are having a fantastic week after Thanksgiving. It's always a little bit different and fun to have that long weekend and have all that extra time with family, although most of us are already getting a lot of extra time with family as it is. But yeah, I hope you're enjoying it. Um, this week, I picked out seven cards from our Go Find It deck and we will see what we can find outside. So the first item to find this week is something that goes crunch. Something that goes crunch. The second item for this week is something small. Something that would fit in that circle. And again, that circle is about the size of the tip of my pinky finger. So maybe you can use your grown-up's pinky finger as the measuring for the small item you find. Our third item, something heavy. Something heavy. That reminds me of when, uh, when I used to go to the park with my boys. We always went to Woodlands Park when they were really little because we lived in the North Rose Hill neighborhood of Kirkland. And there's this enormous boulder that's along the path to the playground there and they called it the big heavy rock and every time we would enter the park and exit the park they had to go to the big heavy rock and give it a pat and maybe sit on it for a couple of minutes before we left it was super fun really really cute memory alrighty the fourth item to look for is something furry something furry and again if that furry thing you find is alive if it's an animal don't touch it unless it's your animal, of course, uh, but like if it's a squirrel or a bunny rabbit, you know, you keep your distance, but it'll still count as your furry thing, even if you can't touch it. All right, the fifth object that we are looking for this week is something yuck, something that makes you think, ew, yuck. Maybe something you don't want to touch. Maybe something you do want to touch. <laughs> so have fun with that. All right, number six for this week is something thick. Something thick. Wonder what you might find. And the last item, number seven, is something soft. Something soft. All right, so something crunch, something small, something heavy, something furry, something yuck, something thick, and something soft. I wonder what you could do with all of those things. Maybe you could make a list of the items that you find and make up a story about them. Maybe a thick furry yuck picked up something soft and heavy and then stepped on something small that went crunch. I don't know. Could be anything. <laughs> Have fun. All right, friends. Should be a fairly dry day this or dry uh, weather week here in the Northwest. So. That'll be good. If you're elsewhere in the country, I know we do have some friends in Pennsylvania and some friends in Texas, uh, friends all over the place this year. So have fun. Um, maybe tell me what the weather's like where you are now. Let me see some of the objects you find. I can't wait to hear about some of the fun things you are doing outdoors. Uh, just remember to have fun, get dirty, and you will see me again with next week's scavenger hunt video. Take care, friends. Bye-bye.